two. We're going to do a um, collective reading message for today. It will be timeless, though, so it's not really for today. It'll be for a long time. All right, we're oops using ooh what are they I can't remember the name of them starts with an L I can't remember all right we're using these ones today and we have some oracle cards here we have the shapeshifters uh, what is it Oracle of the Shapeshifters, the Spirit Animal Oracle Cards, and the Chakra Wisdom. And anything else that I'm drawn to pull for you guys, I will. Please like, share, and subscribe. Um, Alright, let's begin. The Ten of Cups. Coming to an end of a phase, right as rain. So... Your, all your cups are full, your home life is happy, and um, you're doing, you just got everything you want at the end of this phase, and you're going to be beginning a new phase, <laughs> like I said, justice, justice is about, um, it's about taking a look at all the lessons you've learned, and uh, integrating them. It's about getting a clean slate for this new big chapter in your life. It's more than a, <clears throat> bigger than a phase. It's about balancing the scales. It's about just making sure that you're on track, you're on the right track, you're being kind, and so that all good things come your way you know so you keep these scales balanced in this next phase chapter <laughs> keep an open mind and an open heart it's a new adventure it's uh try not to cap yourself or your opportunities of absorbing the whole of the situation or the adventure no expectations, no what ifs, no, um, just n don't cap it, don't cap it. Be open to absorb the whole of the opportunity and the adventure. And the two of staves. So, with that passionate, adventurous energy, you're clean slate <laughs> in your happy happy home life it's time to take whatever it is that you want next maybe out of this new adventure and launch it into the universe launch it yep it's about rebirth it's a fast passionate energy Launch it into the universe. Take them forward steps needed to work together with the universe. And uh, it will return it tenfold and quickly. Okay. Let's see. Let's go on to the shapeshifters. That's an awesome reading. Quick, but uh, lots of new, new opportunities coming. Don't pass any of them up. Keep an open mind and an open heart and keep your heart, your your vibration high. Yep. Do good things. We're all healers, right? All right, let's see. We have the Frog Princess. Heed wise counsel and listen. So, no, nope, not so much talking, but listen yep and uh if anybody gives you advice i suggest you take it <laughs> little wolf girl it is all right to be alone yes <clears throat> i love the silence 
um, it's okay to be alone. This is where we are able to self-reflect in the deepest manner and clear all that stagnant traumatic energy out of your chakras and just see the truth of what's inside and what to do and where to go. Yep. Little Red Riding Hood. I am not a victim. That's awesome. That's a good message. I am not a victim. That's part of the mindful, um, being mindful uh, affirmations. And that I included in my meditations, which I think I'm going to launch today, in fact. We'll see. The, the meditation things are all ready. I just have to record, record the guided meditation. I've been getting lots of good advice from lots of good people. And I think it's about ready. While I believe this was the card of the day, too. Polar Bear. Mystic. This must be really big. Because I think it was last week's, too. Know what challenges make you stronger. Have faith when you face adversity. Take time to rest dream and renew your strength embrace your psychic abilities you carry the shaman within it's a very powerful card very beautiful so if you are not sure about your gifts or anything like that just know you can <laughs> Be alone, self-reflect, and figure it out. If you need any guidance, go to minasays.com and I'll help you out. Alright, some chakra wisdom. Your second chakra, your sacral chakra. Abundance. I am worthy and I deserve an abundance of anything that I require. Not want, require. I watch my thoughts to ensure that I am honoring and respecting myself. I honor myself by knowing that I am worthy to receive. I am open to receive now. I remind myself that it is a uh, sign of strength to ask for help that's been going around a lot lately asking for help a lot of people need to be reminded that it's okay and it takes the stronger person to actually ask for help versus a weaker person all right let's see should we pull a star seed for all the star seeds out there star seed oracle cards I'm going to do a, a reading of these today, too, for myself and <laughs> probably for others, too. Maybe I'll do it on YouTube. I don't know. We'll see. You're not, you're not for everyone. Embrace your weirdness. Yes. Face your true north. <laughs> yeah. I love it. Embrace your weirdness, because we're all weird. I don't care what anybody says. I know I'm weird. I love being weird. All right, you guys, like, share, and subscribe. Thank you. Have a great day.